guys, thank you so much for tuning in. Today's video is another Dollar Tree bath bomb video. Last week we made Disney inspired ones and this week we're making Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. And everything to make these is at Dollar Tree except for the citric acid but that is only $3 at Walmart. And guys, if you find these videos helpful and you like them, please don't forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't. Anyway, let's get started. I started by mixing all of my dry ingredients in a bowl, a cup of baking soda, half a cup of citric acid, half a cup of cornstarch, and half a cup of Epsom salt, and I mix this really well. If you're using the Epsom salt from Dollar Tree, the one that's lavender, you don't have to add essential oil, but I did anyway. So now for the wet mixture, I did a teaspoon of water and three teaspoons of oil. You can use whatever oil, but I used almond oil. And then your optional essential oil and two drops of food coloring and you're going to mix this up and even though it doesn't mix because it's oil and water that's okay so now you're going to put this mixture into a spray bottle to make the bath bombs i used a 3.25 diameter mold but you can use a dollar tree clear ornaments and what i did was i separated the amount that i wanted into a separate bowl because this mixture makes four of the 3.25 molds so now with my wet mixture, I just combine the two very slowly so it doesn't activate and you're going to want a wet sand consistency where it clumps together. So you'll see that in a second and I'm sorry I didn't get an exact clip of it but it's in my last video. So once I got that wet sand consistency, I packed both sides of my mold really well and I added a pop of color with some sanding sugar but you can just mix another color and add that to the middle, which I show you in my last video. So now I press both sides of the mold together very tightly and you should still be able to lift the top. So with this Ninja Turtle cookie mix that I found at Dollar Tree, they also sell at Walmart by the way, I just pulled off the edible images which are basically sugar sheets so they're very very safe. And with a moist napkin, I just wet it a bit so it sticks to my bath bomb and I placed it directly onto the bath bomb being very, very gentle because it's still wet. Once I have the placement that I want, I put the lid back on tightly and the images should be set. And I did this to all of my bath bombs. Normally I would let these dry in the mold, but this time I wanted to release them from the mold so I can smooth out the edges. So I just banged it a bit with my spoon. After I carefully remove the top, I just place it securely on my palm and do the same thing to the other side. So once it's out of the mold, you can use a spoon or your fingertips and just carefully smooth out the side so it's perfectly round. So even though this is the same recipe as the Disney bath bombs, this turned the water green immediately. And the fizz wasn't as intense, but it did last longer. And that's it guys, you have Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle bath bombs. If you like these videos, please don't forget to give me a thumbs up and thank you so much for watching. Till next time.